Hey guys, Nick with Phone Arena here, and if you're looking for a smartwatch, this is one you should check out. The Samsung Gear Sport is packed with more features than you might expect, and it has some serious water resistance properties. But it sticks to a classic design, so it doesn't look too geeky or distracting. But its centerpiece is the bright and beautiful AMOLED display. It is a bit smaller than the one on the Gear S3, but it is bigger than the one on a base Apple Watch. It is surrounded and protected by a rotating bezel, which is used for navigation, and it is as reliable as always, responding with a satisfying click when turned. And on the sides are two well-exposed physical buttons for the back and home functions. The watch itself is comfortable enough to be worn all day, at work, in the office, or of course while doing sports or exercises. But I wouldn't recommend sleeping with it. The strap that comes in the box looks fine and holds on securely to my wrist, but can be swapped for something fancier since the watch is compatible with standard 20mm straps. Sadly, I would say that the Gear Sport just doesn't look good enough on a lady's hand. It is too big and has a rather masculine look. So, what can the Gear Sport actually do? Well, as any other smartwatch, it offers a variety of watch faces to choose from. Some are classic in appearance and resemble an analog watch. Others add numerous complications that display status or activity information. And some are just plain fun. By default, the screen is set to turn off automatically to save battery and turns back on when you look at your watch. But you can enable an always-on display feature, which honestly looks pretty cool. Using the rotating bezel, you can flip through various widgets that give you quick access to things like health data and activity stats, the weather conditions or your calendar. And this is what notifications look like. You can read incoming instant messages and even reply to them by speaking out your response. Or you can use one of the predefined answers or the built-in keyboard with predictive text support. The Gear Sport runs on Samsung's own Tizen operating system. Overall, the software feels very fast and responsive with its fluid navigation. Cases of lags and slowdowns are almost absent. Something that does feel kind of slow, however, are the voice commands, which could really use some improvement in the future. Sadly, the selection of applications isn't as rich as what you'd get out of competing smartwatch platforms, but there are some apps that are nice having, such as Samsung Pay, Uber, or Here We Go Maps for Navigation. Another app that is worth mentioning is Spotify. You can actually pair a set of headphones directly to the Gear Watch and stream music straight from it. You can even save music offline on the watch itself, and there is space for about 500 songs, more or less. As the name suggests, the Gear Sport is made to be a great fitness companion. And in practice, the watch does a good job when it comes to tracking activities like running or hiking, or exercises that you could do at home or at the gym. It is also one of the very few smartwatches that are water-resistant up to 50 meters. In other words, you can take this guy in a swimming pool or even in the ocean. Unfortunately, the Gear Sport falls short when it comes to tracking actual sports. For instance, I play soccer several times a week, and there's no way I can track that kind of exercise. If I choose the running preset, the exercise data that I get is extremely inaccurate, and if I let the automatic exercise tracking feature take over, it shows very little actual data once I'm done playing. Of course, your experience may vary depending on the kind of sport you are playing, but judging from what I saw, the Gear Sport needs further improvement when it comes to sports tracking. As any other smartwatch, the Gear Sport needs to be recharged every once in a while. In my experience, it lasts between 2 and 3 days on a single charge, which is very good for a watch of this class. But if you enable the always-on display mode, the battery life pretty much gets cut in half. In conclusion, the Samsung Gear Sport isn't perfect, but it is still one of the better smartwatches you can get right now. It is fast and good-looking, but it is also reasonably tough and can be safely used in water. And depending on the kind of activity you do, it might also prove a decent fitness companion. With a price below $300, the Gear Sport is a smartwatch well worthy of attention. Thanks for watching, guys, and subscribe to our YouTube channel to never miss a video.